Stay a while and listen. Hello, we're back, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the Freak Show once more. That's right, we're playing Battle Brothers Warriors of the North DLC. We are actually the Northern Raiders, which meant that we had to run all the way south just to get some new people and stuff. And I need to actually set up the new people and stuff. I uh, need to get people, and it's it's going to be a thing. We're pretty hurt. We're banged up. We need to spend some money. It's not looking it's not looking great. So, let us begin here. Oh boy. Um All right, so here here's the thing that I I've I've kind of gone over in my head and I I don't particularly like it. And that's I've talked to other people that have played the game, and they said that they've seen videos where when you try people out, it shows a lot more information than it does for me, so I'm assuming there's mods that allow you to do this. Now, I don't want the mods, but if other people know of the mods and they want to put it like in the comment section, for other people who would want to use them, by all means, go ahead and do so. I definitely think it's something the developers might want to look at because you don't really get much for the money that you pay up front. Or, sorry, for the uh, tryout. So the way I see it, if you're going to go ahead and try someone out, it should lower the cost of their upfront price. So if you pay 40, even if it's not a directly like this guy would then cost 110, which I think even that would be okay. Uh, cut it by like half of this. So if you try them out for 40, then cut 20 off of this and hire them for 130. Because all you really do is you get to learn this, if there's an unknown character trait there. Um, what the mod was doing, what the person I was talking about was telling me, was it would show like how many stars they had in like melee combat, melee defense, you know the star ratings that you have where you get bonus hit points or whatever the case is each level up. It was showing that information and I think that's a really good idea. I like that, but well, it is what it is. It doesn't do that. I'm going to try them out, but yeah, see it doesn't lower this at all. And I feel like that's not right. This is one of the things that it's a cool idea that they had, but I feel like they need to give us more for trying people out. Because I would rather just straight up hire someone, even if they're slightly bad, and then eventually get rid of them later on down the road. There's not really a lot of advantage, early on anyway, to hiring people, or to trying people out before you hire them. That's just my thoughts. I could be to totally wrong, you guys can completely disagree with me. You are fine to do that. I'm going to bring Guido along too. It's a bit expensive, but we're going to do it. Um... So, hmm, what else we got? I just want to see what kind of like weaponry and stuff we can buy. I don't think we're gonna get any more people right now. We might, but I don't think so. Well, we need some food. This is an overpriced. A staff sling? A leather sling on a staff used to hurl stones at the enemy with stones abundant everywhere. It can never run out of ammunition. That sounds cool. Maybe I'll give that to the monk. Oh, God. Maybe I'll give that to my monk. Ooh, we are out of money. I'll sell this. I'm going to see if I can't get to a better town to sell the other one. I can't get a mission here. That's fine. All right. So, we need to... Bring people into the fray here. Now I know that I did a thing. Um, I changed the name from I think it was Seamus the lecturer to uh, Ronald the Red Crow because the red beard. Seamus still would have worked well there, but I think I'm gonna just. I knew I was getting more people, and I was hoping I'd get someone with the red hair, but I don't have it. So you're gonna become Seamus, and hopefully you are okay with that. You just basically get to live twice, man. Uh, as I said, I, I made a mistake in my leveling up, and I had to basically just recreate where we were. So, yep, that was a that was a change that I made that I just kind of swept under the rug type situation. It's fine. All right, and then for you, for you, I think we're gonna make you John the Blue because why not? So we have John the Blue, who's gonna be kind of on the front lines. Survivor, he won't die. Um, he's a craftsman. I think I'm going to swap you guys, though. I know you're probably proficient with pitchforkery because you're a farmhand, but... Uh, 
I think I'm gonna put you on the front lines and put you on the back. I'll give you this. Um, I think I'm gonna give you the staff sling. I think that's kind of cool. I'm gonna take the hat off of you. Put it onto you. And I'm probably gonna give you the gambeson, the blotched gambeson. All right, and we're gonna try, like I said, we're gonna try to keep this until like later, if possible. All right, something like that. Hopefully they don't have like further complications with their wounds or anything. That's possible, but let's hope they don't. All right, I kind of want to head south to see what this place has to offer, so I think I'm gonna do that. I don't think combat is really a thing that we can do super easy, so probably not gonna push that or make that happen if I can help it, but yeah, you never know. Oh gosh, was there 11 of those? Well, whatever, I don't want to fight 11, like, there was like 3, maybe. But definitely not 11. Alright, there's not really much here, which is fine. Another staff sling, which I think is hilarious. Ooh! I actually want this guy, I'm hiring him. I don't know how good or bad he's going to be, but... I was hoping to find one of these, and I did, so... Because it is one of my people that I'm going to be bringing, the Exiled Bard. So Tech, the Exiled Bard, joins the squad, and boom, there he is. I think I might shift everything this way. I, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing 100% yet. We're figuring it out. We're, we're kind of learning as we go here. I didn't give you a weapon, and that's my mistake. I wanted to give you that. I would like a shield or two, but we don't have a lot of money. So let's see what we can do here. Uh, I, need, I need a place by the name of the Stonefist Keep Ruins located, maps incomplete. So this is just a find thing. Can you pay me more? Yeah, that was 10 more, right? Yeah, I'll accept that. Uh, stone to the northwest. I accept the contract. That's a contract that we can do. It, it spends time for us to actually, you know, recover our, from our wounds. Uh, it'll pay us, which is fantastic. And there's very little risk at this point. So all of these are really, really good things. And it's right there. Cool. I said it was to the north and west. I set it up here. So, and in the descriptor that I was reading earlier. So pretty, pretty straightforward quest, mission, objective, whatever. Um, not really ready for any more combat missions right now, but we definitely need to get paid for this one. Oh yeah, we, we are paid. We have enough food and drink. Now what is this one going to be? Uh, the men said they saw some oddities out in a spot by the name of some ruins. Let's talk money. 320... I'm going to accept the offer, but but I'm 100% sure I'm not going to do that one right now. That one seems silly, so we're going to leave. We're going to head back up. Probably go this way. So we're going to take our, our meager earnings that we have gathered thus far. And we are going to head to the, the, the Dre Graffin. Fast turn walked. Oh, there's eight brigands. That's too much for us. Right, what else we got? Anything? Any horrible things waiting in the in the wings there? No? Your company seems to have caught the attention of a messenger on the road. Hey there! You should know that Dre Graffin is looking for men of your kind. Find your way there, and you may have a new job yet. Thanks. It work, you say? That's, that's exactly where we're going. These are good things. These are glad tidings. Be even gladder tidings if I make it before the night. Ugh, I did. Whew. Okay, marketplace. Can we sell this thing? Oh, we can sell this for so much more. I wish I didn't have to squander the other one. Okay. Ooh. That's not good. Mm, not good either. Another staff sling. More expensive. Some shields. Which I kind of want. What is this thing? A war fork. Pitchfork reforged into a battle weapon. Oh, that's neat. 116, I think I can afford that. 
Okay. Well, let's see what we got now. Let's see what we got. We got ourselves some better armor. This is what, 110? Oh, sorry, this is 80. Sorry, the, the 110 is the chain. So I'll put this on you. Sorry. Um, you're going to get this. 65. Blotch the 60. 70. Oh, blotch is better than. Okay. Well, that's unfortunate. Okay, some shields. You're gonna be the two-handed weapon guy, so I'm not gonna put a shield on you right now. Hit you up with some shielding action. We have this. I probably should put it on someone. I think I'll put it on uh, on Tech, the exiled bard. We have the the linen tunics. Isn't this John the Blue? It is John the Blue. Let's get John the Blue a blue tunic, because why not? This makes more sense, right? Our food situation's not great. It's not terrible. It is what it is. What else we got here? We got a tavern. We have a temple. Trying to make our people a little bit less uh, unhappy. Alright, what do we have? Leans over, looks at us. Easy enough. Um, need to be paid more for this. I accept your offer. Secure the ruined wheat fields near... Okay. I'll need some time to think about it. So we'll see what else we have available. Uh, I need a place found. that lies south and west of here. Okay. I will accept that offer. I think I'm going to do that one. South and west of here. That's, again, one of those easy ones. It's about to be nighttime, so... So this is one that, again, low risk. I don't know if I'd say high reward. That might be overstuck. Oh, good. One of our wounds healed. Nice. And this is going to heal in the next day or two. We're looking for the skull. Oh, definitely don't want to mess with the dire wolves. At least not yet. I am trying to avoid the dire wolves, just, just FYI. Do we have enough food? What's this? Overgrown tombs? Hello? Around the region of Scald. Oh, over, oh, over there. Oh, okay. Along the way. Oh, okay. The stranger is a lone man who keeps his distance one foot on the path and the other inching toward escape. Hey there, he glances across your men, slowly smiling as though he can sense our being lost. Searching for the sanctum of uh, of the dark arts, are you? Well, you hand me 30 crowns. Come after me with your swords and I'll be gone quicker than you can blink. No, we need to find it on our own. I'm assuming it's almost directly west of us. Oh, there's so many things out here. Apparently I'm not right. Maybe it's right down here. Maybe I should have paid the 30. Oh, I will kill you. This is a combat I will absolutely take. And possibly find my, my place along the way. Oh yeah, I can fight one of you. Unless he's like super big and then just murders the whole squad. Which is also exceptionally possible. Alright, we're gonna wait it out. You think he's just gonna flee from us or you think he's gonna actually show himself? <gasps> he's quite large. I'm quite concerned now that I, I see him standing there. I know he looked bigger on the map, but I was hoping maybe it was just a representation, but nope, this is a big one. This might kill us. I may be regretting my decision to come after him. Oh dear. Well, he didn't attack yet. That's probably a good sign. Oh, I don't like this. 
I don't like this at all. Okay. Okay, alright. It's fine. It's probably fine. Nope, it's not good. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. Oh boy. Stab missed. Step up and chuck. Hey, we hit him. Ooh, ooh, we did a thing. What is this thing that we did? He's dazed. What does that mean? Oh, that's cool. All right, good. Yeah. Oh, God, please don't kill us. Oh. Yeah. All right. Seriously? Go, friend rear. Go. Ha! Haya! Haya! I'm going for the decapitation. It didn't work. I tried. All right, doggo, get him. All right, John, what you got for me? Nothing. All right, Seamus, come on. All right, Tech, the exiled bard. Sing us a song. No, Foster the Bear. Foster the Bear. Yeah. Oh, that was so much more stressful than it should have been. But we did it. We killed it. And we're pretty happy that we killed it. Still haven't found the thing I'm looking for, though. Which I'm not going to lie. It's a little bit troubling. Uh, so many are interested in the blah, 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 blah. Look, I'll tell you exactly where it is. Just far to the northeast of here in the forest. Uh, I don't know if I've done good or ill. That's the sort of fun I like. To the forest? Like here? Or is he talking like way over here? I feel like... I feel like there's a... He did say north and east. Because the Scald is here. Or is this whole thing the Scald? And didn't I go through the forest? I feel like I went through the forest to start with. Well, it's definitely not there. Alright, well, we're going into the forest, I guess. Not sure this was worth our uh, trip, but we did, we did get to kill something, and our, our guys have actually fully healed. So, yeah. Ooh, what's this? He's a night owl. Yeah. Hello? 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 Uh, so many interested. I'll tell you exactly where it is. It's close by to the west here in the forest. Well, thank you, game, for me being back. Yeah, I would have totally missed that. Okay, we're, we're heading back. That's That was really close. I had to get like right on top of that. We're almost out of food. Definitely seen better days, but you know what? We got some money. Crown's well deserved. Well, you say that, and yet... I'll pay for that. Bit on the expensive side. Archery contest. I wish. Alright, what do we got? Uh, an item's missing. Uh, can you pay me more for this? I accept your offer, but I'm going to need some time. I think we're going to go for the first one. Oh, it's directly south of us. Alright. Well, wish me luck, folks. This could be the, our death here. 
Brigands scurry from a campfire as you near the wheat fields. Surprisingly, they arm themselves. And they come out to defend their newly acquired territory. So they're just like claiming, oh, goody. Uh, sorry guys, my dog is having one of her little episodes. It's no fun. It is no fun. Alright, I don't know that we can win this. Like, I feel like our people are not skilled enough to do the job we need them to do. I'm actually very concerned. That's not good. Slightly better. Nope, oh, that didn't do anything. Alright, well, I guess we're stepping up here now. That's not nearly enough. Oh boy, we are going to have ourselves the worst conceivably possible time ever. Can we even sort of hit somebody with this? Nope. Nope, can't do it. Okay. There's so much bad Juju Magumbo going on, it's sort of insane. Okay, don't swing up him. That hurt. You're gonna come up and smack our... What did you... Did... So, I felt like he did something to me. Maybe it was a morale change or something, I don't know. Alright, step up and gnaw on you. I don't know what I should be doing with you. Let me come down here. I'm gonna shield up and swing on you. I know you just ignore shields anyway, so it's probably not really the smartest of plans, but it's what I'm working with, so I guess you're just gonna have to deal with it. Maybe I can hit you in the head? Nope. Big swing! Big swing again. Oh, I did a little bit of work there. Oh, okay. Well, we, we've killed arguably, arguably the most dangerous person. Actually, not sure if he's the most dangerous, but arguably he is. Oh, God. Okay. That's good. This is not good. Neither is that. Oh, okay, they're splitting their hate. I guess that's not the worst thing ever. It's bad that we're missing our attacks, though. Please hit him in the head. Or at all. Like, seriously, man. Okay, he totally missed. That's a good sign. Okay, he freaked out. That's good. Now, all we really need is for him to freak out, which I don't know that we can make happen, but we're gonna try. By golly. Please land a thing. <gasps> he landed a thing. Oh, oh, we did it. We did it, oh my god. I was so scared. I thought for sure we were done. I thought for sure this was gonna end in my death. Or in somebody's death. Probably Foster's death, if I'm being 100% honest. But, a lot of decapitations later. Another wound with a broken nose, split nose. Uh, it's content with now, now being in reserve. Yeah, maybe we'll do that. Um, Yeah, three kills for Renald the Red Crow. Good for you, man. Two for Tech the Exiled Bard. Oh, we got some more realish weapons at this point. Which is phenomenal and much needed. And we're going to get paid. A ru as rough a fight as there can be, you can you gather your men and are ready to return to the Elder. Oh yeah, we do. We definitely return to the Elder here. Uh, I have a group of men going back to the wheat fields so that they can rebuild. I will need you to escort them. Got it? Good. Um, sorry? I, I'm definitely not ready to go back to the wheat fields. Thank you. Foster, well, guess what, buddy? You now have an actual axe. I know, I too am impressed. 20 to 30 versus 15 to 30. Alright. 
give you that. Well, I don't even hate the idea of you. You know what? I'll just give you the flail. Why not? We'll give you a flail. There you go. We, we don't have any shields, though, which I'm very unhappy about. A sword of 30 to 40, which is maybe better. 30 to 40 as well. 10 max fatigue. This is 4. 20 to 75. 35 to 80. There's armor. I'm going to keep the cleaver. I will actually have a cleaver boy this time with us. I'm going to go again with another one-handed uh, weapon master at some point. I, I, I kind of like that idea. It was uh, it was slow going, but I, I did enjoy that last time we had that. Um, I don't know. I'm very underwhelmed with your performance so far, Mercius, but we'll see. Well, one good thing is we are we are back here. And we can fix his face, but it's expensive. I, I don't think we can. I don't think we can afford to fix his face. Uh, I guess we'll get more food. No, nope, can't really afford that either. All right, it's been a long journey there and back and there again. But it seems Weedfield is now about to get its legs underneath itself again. After making sure the workers are safe, you start to trip back to get paid. I feel like that was not easy crowns, thank you, but I'll take it, I guess. Alright, let's see what this is. Uh, we're definitely not doing... Well, it says it's a shipment. Two days. What does it pay? Okay, so 110 and 440. I want to be paid more. 110, 440. No, that's it. Accept your offer. Provisions will be provided. We have enough money to pay our people. I need some time to think about it. I think I'm gonna break off the episode here, guys and gals. I'm just happy that we survived that horrible, horrible battle. Um, probably gonna sell stuff here. Probably keep the rest of this stuff just in case we decide to hire any more people along the way. Um. Probably gonna take the escort mission, or sorry, the escort, the caravan. Yeah, that's escort mission, the delivery, whatever it is. Um, but I'm not sure. Not sure what I'm gonna do. Either way, that's it for this episode, ladies and gentlemen. I do hope you guys enjoyed. I'm so happy that we survived that fight. I really thought the two-handed sword, sorry, two-handed axeman was going to chop our heads off, but we managed to kill him before anything terrible happened on his front. And then we managed to survive the rest of it due to the one dude switching his targets and kind of sharing the pain with everyone. So take from that what you will, and I will take the victory from there. And let's do this. Before we do, before we break off the episode completely, um, Seamus. We, we're going to change Seamus up. There it is. It's going to be, you going to have red hair. Do we have more red hair, or is it just that one? All right, it's that one. Um, I'm going to give him a mohawk. And yeah, the big old, the big old beard. There we go. You have a tattoo, huh? There we go. I like it. There we go. That is uh, now the, the Seamus that we wanted. The Seamus that we needed. The Seamus that we love. Also, still want some shields. Do we? Do they have shields here? They do, actually. That's eh, a bit expensive, but we're taking it. And we're gonna give Seamus a shield. And we're gonna give no one else a shield for right now. So we have a shield in reserve at this point. So that's good. I like that. All right, guys and gals, that's it for now. Until the very next episode, my name is Bumpy McSquigums. Thanks for stopping by the Freak Show and checking out my Let's Play of Battle Brothers, Warriors of the North. And I still don't know specifically when I'm going to live stream to do the Peasants of Doom, but I'm definitely planning to do that at some point. So keep it locked here. Keep your eyes and ears to the ground, or maybe just your ears to the... Yeah. Just listen out, guys and gals, and I'll try to put the information up as soon as I know what that information is. Until the next episode, I'm Bumpy McSquigums. Thanks again. See you later. <laughs>